Welcome back to the channel, everybody. And today we have a, first of all, we have a Gartley cell pattern on a lower time frame. but I just wanted to talk to you about the cycles we can see in front of our eyes. Now, Mellon's Trade, obviously a big proponent of the number three in trading, three becoming one. Um, here we go on, so this is oil in front of us, and there are three cycles here. We have the first cycle down here. This is on the way up. The second cycle here, and this is the third. Now, why isn't this? Uh, why isn't this two? Why isn't this three? It's not so much the number of pips; it's more the group that they're in. But this is just to fool you, really. So much like that on the way up, it's like this on the way down. So we know we're in a sell structure. We accept the we expect the price to come down um, in this manner. So moving forward and looking at a nearer time frame, let's start on the daily. Can it be seen on the daily? Can be seen on the daily. There's an ABCD pattern. You can see one, two, three to the low, but you can see this A, B equals C, D. Now, there will be a reaction. We are looking for a higher low point in this. So we're looking for a higher low. And we can see here that this ABCD pattern has come in exactly to the point, really, um, up here. So that's D. So let's go down another time frame. Let's go down to the hour. So on the hour, we all see that, that maybe it needs to be the four, probably be better to see that in. So in this four hour chart, there's a lot of things going on, a lot of things. Let me draw them. First of all, we have the ABCD. AB equals CD. Here's the AB leg. There's a CD leg. So it's brought us into this area at the minute. I mean, I might be off a little bit here, but I don't think I am too far off. Let me just adjust this exactly. So that's in line there. Copy, put it on there. That's better. So that's a better fit. And the reason that's a better fit because it's more accurate. So, you know, I know it's a bit spooky. That's what it is. A, B equals C, D in line with the pattern. Remember, expecting the pattern lower. So what can we see here? We can see here that this is a high and you can see that this is a low and I can just copy it. We, we, excuse me, that's a low. And then I can just copy that across another high. What are we expecting? Another low. It's not rocket science, guys. It really isn't. And if you just draw a bit of a trend line here. I hate trend lines. You could probably expect price to get down to this 72 area. Um, now, just looking a little bit more forensically at this, I want to now show you how these measurements are working. So within the ABCD structure, we have point A here, we have point B here, we have point C here, and we have D. So at this moment, AB equals CD in length. Exactly, exactly. So in this CD leg, what can we see? Well, I mean, we can see one, two, three. We can see three pushes up. Um, I'm not making it up. I'm just showing you. You can see three pushes up. What else can you see? Okay, well, there's also another A, B, C, D leg in there. Okay, cool. Well, show me. There it is. A, B, C, D. Okay, so that A, B, C, D leg finishes here, though. Let me change this color of this guy. Change it to green. <laughs> So this ABCD finishes here, though, and the pattern's up there. Yeah, that's because it's a variation. A variation means that it's not just going to be AB a, equals CD. That happens 60% of the time, which is very good odds on its own anyhow. But this little gap up here is where the variation is. So let's just measure that variation. The variation, you need to, you need to subscribe, like the channel, join the newsletter to find out that information. But ultimately, we are very close to an extension move here. Ultimately, we've completed the big ABCD. And let me just switch this to a color that I can actually get along with. Mm, still not great. But anyway, I just wanted to emphasize the three. Now, the anchor point for all of this is here. As it's a, as it's a selling pattern, I'm going to color it in red. There or there, it doesn't matter. I just like it from here for symmetry's perspective. That is a Gartley pattern. We have the D point measuring in at the 78.6, which it is right at it. And that is it. You know, you'd have a stop loss above here. You let the trade play. So I hope you enjoyed that. It's probably something new to you. Um, it is a fantastic way of getting in line with the trend at an early point. So like and subscribe, reach out, and uh, I wish you all the best. Thank you.